Hi guys, welcome to my video and today in this video I'm going to show you guys how to create a permanent user profile for browser automation. So as a code we written in the last video, this is only create a temporary um, profile user, I mean a temporary browser. So just run it. So as you see when you run it, um, for example when you search uh, something like hello world selenium selenium python and you guys can see the history here it is over here but when you guys close it and turn it back on it's all disappeared and in the history it's only show um, the first thing we search here we just just data and to do that, we need to create a permanent uh, user profile, which is just create a user profile. So every time we open it, we can go back to our progress. So we are not making a new one. So to do it, you will want to create a user data director. So over here, I will just create a key user data director and just put a path in it and I like putting it in the config file again so just profile um, this one I created before so I, I will just download it to create a sample um, let me copy the path config profiles if I name it right yep and I will name it profile you guys, you guys can name it uh, anything you could like but I will just put it as profile so this is the path so when you open um, a new one all the data will be stored in this here profile so in this path and over here um, you will want to create an option variable so this uh, this is for us to add the option in it from option and also um, you will want to add option into it so just option dot add argument and then just create a string user data director equal config dot user data director so for this one here this format here it will create the string um, so it just put this path here and it just creates a uh, user data director so over here we will want to add the option show up so option equal option and let's run it um, there's something wrong here invalid syntax um, let me have a look what's wrong here Um, I forgot the comma here so in dictionary when you have different uh, you have a new key you have to separate it from a comma so this is really a common mistake so just remind it and did you mean options yes I mean options no attribute config
so, sorry guys it was local and user da 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 fix this and here you go so after this it will create a profile here so this will be used to store data in here so when you search um, hello world again maybe hi python Yes. and when you load it it's over here and when you turn it up and you turn it back on the data will be stored in here so this is really useful for us because um, it keep our data so we can use it in the future and also if you guys have been using that um, the temporary uh, ones so it is stored in the temporary file so in window it is stored in app data and temporary I guess but in Linux it is stored in the temp over here this one so um, so for example if you guys want to create a new one so if you want to in the future you want to open multiple fi um, profiles doing multiple stuff so you guys can just change the name so maybe just put profile 0 here and run it and this will create um, a new profile over here profile 1 and Oops. Uh, where's the problem? So maybe you search this is profile zero. And when you turn it off, so when you open the profile zero, so in the history you will see there's a profile zero, but when you just open the profile um, and here you go so the history has changed so the data installed install in different profiles and this is how you create um, the profile to store um, the data per permanently um, and also to this is how you can open the specified profile you want and thank you so much guys for watching so see you guys in the next um, episode. Thank you.